ग्रीटिंग व्यूअर्स वेलकम टू माई दर यूट्यूब वीडियो सो इस वीडियो में मैं आपको सिखाऊंगा कि कैसे आप सिलीनियम के थ्रू और या रिक्वेस्ट के थ्रू किसी डायनामिक वेबसाइट को स्क्रैप कर सकते हैं डायनामिक पेजेस को विच आर लोडिंग फ्राम द जावा स्क्रिप्ट सो इस एज यू कैन सी ऑन माई स्क्रीन इट्स अ रियल टाइम प्रोजेक्ट द करेंट गिव मी अ प्रोजेक्ट दैट यू हैव टू स्क्रैप अ डाटा फ्राम अ वेबसाइट सो ही गिव द वेबसाइट यू आर एल एज वेल सो आई हैव टू लेट मी लेट मी ओपन द वेबसाइट so now i have the website as you can see that it's loading a data uh, dynamically once the page gets loaded then it will be loaded automatically with the help of a uh, javascript so what i have to do uh, maine scraper banana hai jo kya karega is website ko uh, grab karega is website se sara data grab karke excel mein store kare so as you can see the budget of the client was uh, 50 uh, 50 dollar so he just need a date time column like example include title description author date and time this columns he needs in a data framework or we can store into the excel or another uh, csv file text file or in another things so it's depending is completely depending on us so uh, that's the uh, real skills the people who's thinking about that uh, if you want to earn a money through a chat gpt then you can earn 500 dollars 600 dollars per day so it's just a waste of time so uh, let's start before st- uh, wasting any more time instead of stand motor so uh, let's start for starting i'm uh, i have a project on there with the name of a walmart so if you are new on a pycharm then you can click on the py, uh, new project create a project so as the project is already created so i'm just going to open this walmart and right click i'm going to add a new file of a python with the name of a uh, wall street scraper yeah so once the scraper has been once the uh, so file create kar diye so first of all uh, फॉर चेकिंग द सिक्योरिटी ऑफ एनी वेबसाइट वट यू हैव टू डू मैं यहाँ पे रिक्वेस्ट के थ्रू पहले सेंड करूँगा रिक्वेस्ट को और अगर रिक्वेस्ट के थ्रू मुझे टू हंड्रेड रिस्पॉन्स आया तो इस मीन द आई कैन स्क्रैप द वेबसाइट विद द हेल्प ऑफ रिक्वेस्ट बी एस फो ब्यूटीफुल सोप अगर नहीं तो फिर ऑटोमेशन रिजार्ट पे सिलीनियम के थ्रू जाएंगे सो फर्स्ट ऑफ आल हाउ यू कैन सेंड अ रिक्वेस्ट टू द इम्पोर्ट रिक्वेस्ट और रिक्वेस्ट रिक्वेस्ट इम्पोर्ट हो गया सो लेट्स लेट मी ट्राई द रिस्पॉन्स रिक्वेस्ट डॉट डेट so as you can see i sent that response but in a back in a return i got a response 403 so that's why i'm not going to use a 403 so that is a, a forbidden or i'm not allowed to scrap a data from the request uh, so now i'm going to use a selenium so for using a selenium i'm going to import some libraries on there import uh, from selenium import web driver from selenium dot web driver dot common dot keys import keys and that's it so these are the two lab, uh, libraries which i'm going to use at the moment pass i'm going uh, i just created a main and i'm going to use the time library as well just uh, to wait for a while on the page then scrap a data from then start scraping a data from there so uh, how you can run the sc- uh, driver from the selenium so i am going to write down the command driver is equal to web driver dot chrome so you have to indicate the path as uh, many environment uh, path we already defined kar diye chrome ko so that's why i just need to be call a chrome driver dot exe so in my next video mai aapko teach karunga ki kaise aap environment path pe apne chrome driver ko define kar sakte hain path python ko define kar sakte hain taki easily aap cmd se kisi bhi time python ko aur chrome driver ko call kar sake instead of giving a whole path executable path so that's a uh, easy or if if your path is already defined into the environment so you don't have to give the either you don't have to give the chrome path as well so driver dot get now i'm going to make a request of the web page which i'm going to scrap so yahan pe main apne uh, it's a good practice that ke aap jo project create kar rahe ho to saath saath aap kya kare isko console pe run kare aur uh, jo aapko information correct lage ki aapka code correct ho to saath hi usko aap uh, apne ide pe place kar de jahan pe code at once run hoga driver is equal to web driver dot no i did not define the import lab import web driver drive import okay then import now it's done then i'm going to use the same previous command as you can see that my chrome has been started so as the chrome has been started so ab main yahan pe website open karne laga uh, same website so now the website has been uh, begun uh, loading अब वेबसाइट जब लोड हो जाए तो साथ ही क्या करेगा क्रोम ड्राइवर आपको नेक्स्ट कमांड रन करने के लिए दे देगा कि ठीक है ओके सिलीनियम आपको नेक्स्ट कमांड रन करने के लिए अलाउ कर देगा कि नाउ यू कैन एग्जीक्यूट द नेक्स्ट कमांड्स सो बिफोर किसी भी वेबसाइट को स्क्रैप करना है सबसे पहले आपने उसका स्ट्रक्चर देखना है उसके ब्लॉक एलिमेंट्स देखने हैं और ब्लॉक एलिमेंट्स से वन बाई वन आप किस तरह वहाँ से डाटा ले सकते हैं ये सारा कुछ देखना है सो एज द वेबसाइट इज़ ऑलरेडी ओपन माई ऑन माई क्रोम सो आई एम गोइंग टू ओपन इट ओके सो बिकॉज इज नीड अ टाइटल एंड द डिस्क्रिप बाई ओन नेम डेट टाइम एंड द डिस्क्रिप्शन सो आई एम गोइंग टू क्लिक ऑन इट राइट क्लिक 
with the pagination as well so i'm going to divide this video into two parts one of them is going to that how you can scrap a data from the dynamic and the second part would be that how you can store into a data frame or the excel file so let's start uh, as you can see on there is uh, so i'm going to look at the structures so yeah uh, here you go i find out that each articles have their own tag articles so first of all I'm, i need to be grab the articles tag for grabbing it i'm going to make a article web driver ah. driver dot find element okay so uh to python 3 may a it is introduced so you take introduce uh, instead of uh, writing a whole command find element by tag so you just need to be import another library from selenium as it already imported on my code keys or you have my core import connect from selenium dot web driver dot common by import by you will have import karunga taki uh, jo current uh, iska kya kehte uh, jo current iska uh, code write karne ka pattern hai usko hum follow kar sake so usko follow karne ke liye sabse pehle main ek variable declare karunga article where i'm going to be scrap the article tags find element by tag name elements because i'm going to scrap a multiple elements so that's why i just need to be put the name of the elements on there uh, now i'm going to copy the path uh, name of the tag as you can see is a article tag now it's pasted i have a for checking that did i get a proper response from the website but as you can see on the right hand side uh, I, there's a list of 20 articles so i'm going to copy this tag and i'm going to play uh, and i'm going to place it on my code now I'm going to write a for loop just to check that did I get a proper element or proper data from the website or not. So art in article. So just going to print the data, random data. After that, I will make a changes. The text pass. Yeah, copy paste karunga code yahan pe. Okay. So as you can see that I get the response from the website and data as well. So now uh I've managed to appropriate format like and according to the client requirement. So I'm going to clear out the console. Now I'm going to make uh changes on there so first of all uh title i'm going to search the tag of the title we're going to that's the tag of the title themes so now i'm going to grab it because art can the sorry element store in each block so block by block kya hoga ab yahan pe hum move karenge so because art is a uh, is a list so list mein se hum kya kar rahe data ko nikalenge one by one karke art dot find element by class name kyunki main class copy kiya isliye by class name uh print i'm going to write down it print so uh yahan se title scrap karna hai so title scrap karne ke liye main isko format dunga uh art format title that this is a title just to indicate that this is a, this is a title and for the rest of them i need to be copy the after that i need to copy the uh owner name or the publisher name you can say that so just a summary but we need a descriptions we can get the descriptions on the so as you can see that from this uh element i can get the publisher name and the date time so by line so that's the theme of by line where i can get the publisher name so i'm just going to get the replace it because it's, it's also via class so i'm just going to replace it and now i'm going to write the, instead of title i'm going to write the publisher you be like str publisher or the second one is a third one is a date time so date time scrap karne ke liye main date time ka element nikal lu yahan se time zone that's another class for the date time ab yahan se class uh, date time ki bhi element aa gaya so next part is to grab the description so for grabbing a description uh, i need to be such is yeah is a printed text so now uh, the description also has been grabbed uh, so now i'm going to run the test code from there into a console and rename it instead of title from from title to description that's it so as a format so yeah i got the error because the spell of the format was incorrect format format okay so now i'm going as you can see i got the text only so because i did not add the dot text so now i add the dot text as well at the end so now i will get the text instead of the html elements so uh, yeah ye is errors ko baad mein solve karenge because sometimes uh, is uh, some tags some blocks did not have the all the informations like publisher name title or the date times uh, one of the informations would be missing but as you can see that as long as you can see that title publisher date time and the description we got the whole data so we're going to handle the 
we're gonna I'm gonna uh, copy this information I'm gonna paste from there so now I'm going to do uh, some error handling error handling with the try and catch uh, base exception as e print e that's it so now the base exception has been done because uh, each articles pe uh, main ek try and catch pe bhi kaam kar sakta hai lekin each article each block pe kya hai ke uh, kuch information available hai and uh, some informations are missing so that's why i'm going to copy and paste it Uh, so it's depending on you uh, whether you would like to display the errors or not uh, but it's a, it's a good practice that uh, we are testing you display the what's the issue uh, why it's appearing on there why did you, why you are not be able to grab the whole data from there so now i'm going to paste the whole query in my console just to check if it's working fine or not so i'm going to clear out the previous command now it's done so now as you can see that uh, i got that all the data without having an issue i got the error as well which is displaying like an example on there it's saying that message no such element are found so which informations are missing descriptions uh, so the descriptions are missing in this element also descriptions are missing so as you can see on the website as well on the website it's the same element the same elements and one of them did not have the description let's check so yeah as you can see on the stocks to watch friday so it did not have a descriptions so also for getting a complete description we need to get the url behind the title for getting a url behind the title what i'm going to do i'm going to use the same command but uh instead of article i'm going to find out the class with the i'm going to find out the tag with the name of find a find underscore element by dot tag name kyunki jo sa hamara link hota hai wo always a class mein hai so get attribute हरीफ ओके सो अब क्या करूँगा मैं यहाँ पर लिंक के साथ मैं अपना वो भी डिस्प्ले करवा दूँगा सो एज यू कैन सी दैट नाउ इट्स स्टार्ट क्रैबिंग अ लिंक एज वेल सो अब क्योंकि लिंक भी ग्रैब हो गया है ऑलो कॉल सो लिंक से क्या करेंगे नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट पेज को ओपन करके वहाँ से हम डिस्क्रिप्शन को ग्रैब करेंगे सब मैं इसको कॉपी करूँगा और यहाँ पर अपने औरिजिनल कॉल ब्लॉक में पेश कर दूँगा सो नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू मेक अ पेजिनेशन लॉजिक फॉर मेकिंग अ पेजिनेशन लॉजिक वट आई हैव टू डू I have to follow because I have to scrap a data from each pages as well. Okay, so I'm going to right click on the pagination. So that's a good practice if you can find out the page directly uh, via partial link or link test. So I'm going to test that well, uh, if I'm going to grab that if I'm going to find out the element with a single tag or not. Driver dot find by dot link text. Give me the link text tag or just to indicate that you did find now. I'm unable to find out. So now the next thing is to be a class name. सो क्लास नेम से अगर भी ना हो सके तो फिर मैं क्या करूँगा इसके ब्लॉक को टच करूँगा इसके ब्लॉक से डाटा स्कैप पेज को लोकेट करने की कोशिश करूँगा देवर डॉट फाइंड एलिमेंट बाई डॉट क्लास नेम ओके सो आई आई एम एबल टू गेट सम इन्फॉर्मेशन फ्रॉम दे सो डॉट टेक्स्ट अगर मैं प्रिंट करूँगा तो कुछ भी नहीं सो डॉट गेट एट्रीब्यूट हरीफ ओके क्योंकि मुझे हरीफ का लिंक मिल गया एच रिफ का लिंक मिल गया है तो अब मैं क्या करूँगा यहाँ से इसको पेजिनेशन स्टार्ट कर दूंगा पेज को वन बाय वन कलेक्ट करूँगा क्योंकि क्लाइंट की रिक्वायरमेंट है कि टेन पेजेस स्कैप डाटा ऑन ऑल टेन पेजेस सो टेन पेजेस यहाँ पे मैं एक लूप इंप्लीमेंट करूँगा वाइल पेज इज इक्वल टू वन वाइल पेज लेस देन और इक्वल टू टेन सो नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू लोड द पेजिनेशन ऑन दे सो मैं कॉपी को अपने सारे कोड को ब्लॉक को कॉपी करके पेश करूँगा इन द लूप बिकॉज आई हैव टू ग्रैब अ डाटा फ्राम ईच पेजेस और एट द एंड पे मैं यहाँ पे इंडिकेट करूँगा इसको वंस क्योंकि जब ऑल द डाटा फ्राम द पेज फ्राम द करंट पेज गेट स्क्रैप्ड सो यहाँ पर मैंने क्या करना है यहाँ पर मैंने इसको नेक्स्ट पेज को लोड करना है सो नेक्स्ट पेज को लोड करने के लिए मैं सेम ट्रैन कैच यूज़ करूँगा इंस्टेंट इफ आई गेट एन एरर सो ई सो ये आई एम गोइंग टू प्लेस इट ऑन दे क्योंकि मैंने पेज को लोड करना है नेक्स्ट पेज को ड्राइवर डॉट गेट ओके सो नाउ I'm going to add a sleep time, uh, like example twenty minutes. So now let's uh, try to try our full code. I'm going to run the full code just to check whether it's going to work or not. So ah, uh, here I'm going to do one more thing just for the indication that uh, print. Okay, which page load is it? Loading page dot format page. That's it. So it's simple indicator here. सो जस्ट फॉर चेकिंग सो इस वीडियो में हमने देखा कि कैसे आप सेलेजियम के थ्रू डिफरेंट एलिमेंट्स को डिफरेंट टाइटल डिस्क्रिप्शन और डिफरेंट टेस्ट को कैसे स्क्रैप कर सकते हैं ब्लॉक बाई ब्लॉक समटाइम्स ये एक क्योंकि ईजी प्रोजेक्ट था समटाइम्स आपकी जो सी 
extraction our data or scraping our data from the website is not that easy so dynamic automatically dynamically change your data instead of picking our data from the by, with the class so i prefer to use a generic code like example via partial text or some kind of indications so as you can see that on the back and now it's loading the next page as well so the first data has been scrapped so now it's loading the next page because i add the delay uh, time delay the 20 second after loading the page is gonna wait for the 20 second just to see that if the elements gonna be appear on the web page or not so now we get the whole the data from there so uh, next task jo part 2 video is mein mein aapko zikhaunga ki kaise aap uh, store kar sakte hai different uh, 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 scrapped data go into the data frame like using a pandas or with the help of a xlrd uh, excel library so now we are just waiting for the website to get proper load <coughs> So uh, now it's gonna wait for a while. Okay, so uh, if you have, uh, it's gonna work fine now. So if you if you have any other questions or issues, so just let me know. And thanks for watching the full video. And don't subscribe to, uh, forget to subscribe our YouTube channel for more latest videos and uh, tips.